Congratulations, Morocco! You've made history, but now it's time for you to refund. I guess you already find out what happened in a shocking game of the World Cup. Morocco beat Spain and made it to the final eight. So it turns out Morocco is the dark horse of this year's game. In the group stage, they have beaten Croatia, which is the runner-up of the World Cup in 2018. And they have beaten Belgium, which is ranking second in the world right now. And going forward, they are facing Spain. We all know Spain is very good at football, and they have beat Costa Rica seven to zero in the first game. But no one expect it to be a very boring tie. There's there's really nothing to talk about until the penalty game. And I I have to say the goalkeeper of Morocco is so good. He gets the right direction and I think saves two of the goals, and the other hit the gate. So they beat Spain in the penalty game three to zero. So it's really interesting to see this kind of score in the penalty stage. So. Congratulations on making history! You've you've made it. You've beaten so many good teams, and you've entered the final eight. But today, I really want to talk about it's a issue I had with Royal Air Morocco. So, I came to know Morocco when the COVID nineteen hit the world, and I was in the New York City at that time. So, in our attempt to Getting back home, I'm looking for all kind of airlines. You know, a lot of airlines was stopped at that time, and and Royal Air Morocco is one of just a few lines that still are selling tickets. So I book one ticket from them, and then guess what happened? It got cancelled before the departure date. So since then, I'm. I'm trying to get a refund or rescheduled, but. Morocco then went through the lockdown, so the airline didn't operate for a very long time. So a reschedule is not possible. And finally, I have to go through a long way to so to fly to Serbia first, and and then went from Greece to back home. It's a very long journey. I, I think I will talk about it later. But what happened with the refunds? I did get some money from a few of the airlines, but some I'm, I'm still working on. And Royal Air Morocco is one of the very interesting case, I would say. So, because in the first place,、uh, while I was trying to ask for a refund, they refused, and then without asking me, they turned my air ticket into a Virtum. And the virtual is said to be valid for eighteen months, and after that you can, you can do this or do that, and you can ask for a refund. So this year, finally, the virtual is like、uh, no longer valid, and I'm I'm asking them to,、uh, okay, you said you、uh, the virtual can turn into a refund, so can you give me my money back, and. Interestingly, they replied and they agreed and asked for my bank details. So I sent them a bank details in September and wait until today. Nothing happened. I I don't know why. I have I have written them a a, a few emails asking what happened. I have already、uh, provided my bank details. So is there anything wrong? Are you out of money or? I don't know. So what what happened? So I guess、um, I I have no choice but to to urge Morocco here. Look, there's a a lot of green news happening in the country right now. But don't forget to pay、uh, what you have owned. I really wish Morocco could continue to advance in the World Cup. So they are a good team. But for Royal Air Morocco,、I、have one word for you. Refund. So, my friend,、uh, are you also asking for refund from Royal Air Morocco or, or any other、uh, airlines or travel service provider? I'm also curious about your story because it's very interesting. The booking happens in 2020, and now it's already two years later. But I, the refund is still not there. So, 
I think that's really drove me. I I I, I can't say it's not because it's not that big of money, but it's still I'm not getting it like for so long. So that's why when I see the World Cup news and find out, oh Morocco, I know that country and know especially the airlines. So I think I have to make a call here and. I hope you can. Uh, you still like this video, and you can, uh, and help me spread the words. And looking forward to see you next time.